Uh, this problem is from the engineering book mathematics. Exercise 10.1 problem 4. Find the point of the x axis which is equally distant from the point 7, 6 and 3, 4. Note what the point for this problem is. If a point lies on x axis, then its y coordinate is 0. That is y equals 0. Similarly, if a point lies on y axis, point lies on y axis, say m is a point, then its y coordinate is 0. x coordinate is 0, and if the point lies on x axis, then its x coordinate is 0. Okay. In the coordinate system, we have two points. One is 7,6 and another is 3,4. You have to find a point on the x-axis such that the point on the x-axis must be at equal distances from these two points. So let's call these two points as A and a point on the x-axis as B such that BA and BB are of equal distances. That is the length of BA is equal to length of AB. Let P equals x comma 0 be any point on x axis. If you take any point on x axis, then its y coordinate must be 0 because for a point, if a point lies on x axis, y is equal to 0. Let b equals x comma y be any point on x axis such that such that p a is equal to p b. It is demand. Now as you know p a is the distance between the points p and a and p b is the distance between the points p and b. Therefore it is a a problem on distance formula. So this implies square root of x minus 3 the whole square plus 0 minus 4 the whole square that is PA and that is equal to square root of PB x minus 7 the whole square plus 0 minus 6 the whole square using distance formula squaring both sides squaring both sides the square root sign vanish. So I have with x minus 3 whole square plus minus 4 square equals x minus 7 whole square plus minus 6 square. I will expand this using the formula a minus b whole square. It is x square minus 6x plus 9 plus 16 minus 4 square is plus 16 equals Expand x minus 7 whole square using the formula a minus b whole square. So it is x square minus 14x plus 49 plus 36. Or minus 6x plus 14x coming to LHS becomes plus 14x. x square and x square, in fact, both the terms having same signs from other sides, different sides, LHS and RHS, they cancel out each other. And this is equal to 49 plus 36 and this is minus, minus 9 minus 16 plus 9 and minus 16 or on the right hand side now. So for plus 4x minus 6x. This implies 8x on LHS plus 4x 14x minus 6x. Now 49 plus 36. 49 plus 36 is 85 and minus 25 so you have plus 60 on the right hand side therefore x is equal to 60 over 8 or x is equal to you can reduce this that is 15 by 2 4 15 sir and 4 2 sir so x is equal to 15 by 2 therefore the point on x axis, if it has to be at equal distances from 7,6 and 3,4, so 
should be 15 by 2, comma, 0.